Well, hello there, Merlins and Serlins. I'm the F Bomb here in Nick Bro Inc. Oh, and welcome, Trekkies. It's very uh, bright here with the snow on the winter wonderland, so I'm wearing the glasses. Yes, I'm here to go over 2013's, so, I mean, Star Trek Online's 2013's Winter Wonderland. They've added a few things, they've kept a few things, so we're gonna go over some of the stuff. <laughs> So, it's 2013. As it says up here, it should say, 2000, yep, 2013. That's the new ship, we'll get into that soon. Um, Do you so, have any recipes? That's one of the new things. That's pretty fucking annoying. <laughs> uh, hopefully I can get over here and no one will talk. So, we still have... Uh, friendly and friendly Epos. We'll talk about that. So there's still there's still the race here to get the spaceship. Um, Aren't Epo's adorable? I have a video for it. Uh, I have a video for it here. Signals you. You get sent through this loading screen, and then you get rooted. Okay, welcome back. Or if you didn't leave, because I opened that in the new tab. Um, so the race is. Pretty much the same. The only thing that's different is um, something I'll go over in this character. Three, two, one, go. So they've changed a little bit of Q's Winter Wonderland, uh, and I haven't done anything for my Romulan character, so I'm going to do it here. You have to start off by talking to Q. Talk to do Q. Do you have a delightful Oh my treat God! To try? Trust me, those guys get really annoying. I guess I did do it with my character. So first you talk to Q. He'll give you one of those uh, Christmas balls. Uh, the green ones. I forget what they're called. Then you go into your reputation and there is a event project that you start. And it just... Do you have any uh, recipes? The first time I heard that guy's voice it was hilarious. And then, you know, they just don't shut up. Ever. So... Once you do that, it works off your reputation system. You get your green ball, you throw it in the event, and it's Happy just a quick Christmas holidays. event. And once you do that, you unlock the two projects. You unlock the Breen Cruiser, which is what I have last, which is what last year's gift is, and which I have, I will have an annotation to its video now. So apparently, Alt Space is going to fire all. That's pretty cool. Or you can get. The new Breen Raider, Do you which have any I'm working toward now, and I'll have an annotation to it now, but I'll get it eventually. Eventually. Yeah, I thought I could do something different with his character. I thought I could show you better. Um, if you started this, which you have, uh, this started December 5th. It's they're giving us 35 days. I think December ends on the 25th. No, it ends on the 30th, doesn't it? You have until July 5th, January 5th, I did that last year too, so you have a whole month. But the sad thing is, you you can only pick... Where is it? You need 20, 25 days, or 25 uh, completed races in order to get one ship. So you, you really only have time to get one ship. But since they're carrying ships over, if you didn't get one last year, get whichever one you want and then keep race five more times, you'll get, that's 40 times five, you get uh, 200 extra cards for next year. So, I mean, just like stack up your cards. Just do it. It'll, it'll help you out in the long run. All right, that's it for the ships. Um, let's just, there's still the app off tags here. Say something, dummy. Don't you want an Epo friend? Thanks, that was real nice. Okay, so the way you get this is if you do the Fast and the Flurious race, which is a competitive race. And I still have footage from it last year, but before I send you off, I want to say that I didn't finish it <laughs> last year. I lost, and Don't I didn't feel like doing it friend? again. I was discouraged. So, once you do, when you, when you get to the race, there's going to be a little flag. you got to click on it. Depending if you place, you could. So 
Sorry, that was something I wanted to go over All later. Right, so, once you complete the Epoff, the, the, the competitive race, you get a few Epoff tags. Um, do I have any on me? No, I think, she, I think she'll show you. Don't you want an Epo friend? Yeah, here, that's what they look like. Uh, that's what they look like, and it's just a it's just a duty officer mission. And once you get that, you get an ep off. Um, and once you get an ep off, it it's random what color you get. It's they did this last year, and it's like it's like the bird thing. So here's Don't the race. You want an epo friend? Ah, let me go! Let me go! And um, yeah, that's pretty much it for that. There are some new weapons. Ah, I don't want to go. Over, I wanted to go over a bunch of things in line. All right, so they added some new stuff. One thing they added was Q's snowball mortar ornament. Now it's a. Epo's adorable. It's a drop. It's a. It's a consumable item. I have winter item. These to headlet. Let me just go over everything. Okay, these are unmelt unmelting snowballs. You can pick up snowballs here, but you can't use them anywhere else besides the snowball event. These ones that you can buy. With these items, which are cheap, I think you get ten at a time, twenty at a time. I don't know. They um. I have winter you have all the little you have their brain fart. Even you. These. Um. Shit. These you can use everywhere. So that's kind of you just throw them at your friends. These are frosted boots. It says run speed increase, but traction is reduced. Additional effects while on the frozen far. lake in Q's Wonderland. What winter wonderland? I don't know what they do. Okay, so the mortar or ornament. It's a consumable, you drop it. I don't know if you get to use it once or it gets destroyed quickly and then it's gone. Um, it just shoots Epo a bunch friend? of snowballs. It's good for fighting the enemies and the bosses. But if you get the snow guns, you don't really need it. So then there's the scarfs. They've got the 2012 scarf, which is the one I wear, because I think it's cool. They All have the, adorable. the Federation scarf, which I believe is the original scarf in the game. They have an Academy scarf, which they had last year also, and then they have this... Another Federation scarf. Maybe that one's the original. I don't remember. Oh man, look at me. You bring your kids to me, you just put them on my lap, and then I make them never believe in Christmas again. <laughs> so, Santa's here. So, this is one of the uh, Klingon scarves. This is a Klingon scarf for 2012. I actually didn't know they had scarves for the Klingons. I feel a little embarrassed about that. Um, but there are a few... Uh, why am I saying 2012? Why don't I just say Q last year? There are a few Klingon scarves. There's the one I'm wearing, which is the 2012 one. There's also just the regular scarf. I guess it's just a regular scarf for everyone. There's the Elite scarf, which looks interesting. And then there's this trans... trans... Traditional, traditional scarf. Wow, I'm really good you and smart. All the little creatures. So I like the 2012 one the best. Q they did all add the two uh, Romulan you. scarves. I'm not gonna get either of them. I've seen that you can color customize them, but they're just not re they just don't really thrill me. I have That's what they look like. For a bar the biggest pain in the butt is these items. These last two, the Andorian Sleigh Bells and the Bajoran Gratitude Epos. Bells. Beats. The only way you can get those is from doing the uh, snowball fight and defeating the snow Cute snow overlord here. They added two new types of coats. They had a long green jacket. They added this long red jacket. Aren't Epos adorable? I have and there's a bar variant for, bar for each game. jacket. Then they added these new weapons. The, they still have the flurry and the avalanche from last year. The avalanche is like a big launcher. It'll shoot big rounds and then it has Epo's a big adorable. shot. That freaking, um... I have winter oh, and I can buy it for bargain. credit. No, I can't. Okay. So, and it shoot a big shot that'll affect everyone. The flurry is an assault rifle. Aren't Epo's adorable? All the lands of ice and snow. So, that's... So the Flurry is an assault rifle. Those are two from last year. They added the Snowblower, which is pretty interesting. It's got an attack. You can see people doing it. That it doesn't matter what range you are. It'll attack anything in front of it, and it goes on forever. 
It's very interesting. I'm surprised that it's like that. You can just shoot people from like a mile away, apparently, and it'll work. Let's zoom out and see if I can do this. Ugh. There, look at that. What a disaster. Oh, and there's some of the pistols. That's good. That's it, he's dead. That's quick. Everyone's destroying this guy. Uh, Alright. Okay. And to reiterate, the snow cannon, the avalanche, looks like this. It shoots one like this. Fire. And then it shoots one like this. Now, personally, I like things that shoot, like, if you want my opinion, get the ones that shoot a big shot. Because it'll, like, the snowblower, the avalanche, and the big one. Because their secondaries do damage to anything that's around this area of fire. Or for in case of the snowblower, in front of it. So that's good, you can attack a bunch at once. So that was the, so I showed off the pistol there. That was good, that worked out. What's the pistol called? Don't you want an Epo friend? That was the hail and the snowblower. Now, for the big one, I gotta go to another character. Alright, now I said I was gonna go over the other guns, so... A wise man can this... Uh, we have to jump down first, don't I? Whoop. Bonk. Can I use it now? This is the big one. It's interesting, because it's small. It's really colorful. I love it. But, the big one... Uh, it shoots colored snowballs. I've been seeing people do this, and I'm like, this is probably my favorite one out of the new new bunch. Break on the snow or something, dude. Alright, usually the snowballs do break on the snow. I don't know why it's not working here. And you'll see like little remnants of the of the of your red and purple and green snowballs. But what I like so I like that. It's a shotgun. But what what's cool is it will target, since it shoots three balls at least, it'll it'll target up to three enemies. And then it's got the Omega Blast. Which again will just target as many enemies as are as are in its range. So I really like that. I really like this gun. To tell you the truth, this year, that's my favorite gun. Oh yes, that's right. I'm about to talk about this. Okay. So let's go, butthead. So yeah. I said I'd go over these. Don't you doop, want doop, 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 doop. Okay, so there are these nanopulse edge weapons. They're green and purple. A uh, green, they're green. There's a Leaper and there's a uh, Batlath. Now they do this every you year. Loves all the little creatures, and even you. if you were paying attention, the DPS is exactly the same. So yes, if you want one, you can get one. Um, I didn't. But that's what the Batlat looks he Batlat loves looks all like. The little creatures. And Even basically you. it just has like a purple it's like a lightsaber pretty much. It's just a purple Batlath in the middle of it. Now I can't I, I can't use it here because you can't use weapons that aren't winter related and this one isn't. It's he just re it's a really powerful Batlath. Even you. I just uh, suck with the purple one. I may get the green one for this character, but probably not. Um that's it, it's just a melee weapon, but it's exactly the same as last year's, and it's exactly the same as two year, as the, the year 2011's. For 2011, the clans got red ones, and the Federation got blue ones. So it's exactly the same. So that's all I have to say about that. The ground combat pet, it's just a snow pet. Nothing. Alright, now... All of these guys are annoying, they've added tons of new voice acting, as you can tell. I think the only one that I can experience here is the Breen guy, which I actually did record before I started doing this. Okay. I have winter so, you could do the winter bargain. race. You could do the competitive race. You can do this pie-eating contest, which I'm going to do right now in front of all of you, because, you know, it's really easy. Let's pie make a tasty contest, treat Breen. Together. Pie eating. Except. Ugh. Okay. So what you do is Peach you just sit here, is good for business. and you just eat the pies. And you yell at your guy, like, eat it, you fat freak. Just shove the pies in your face. Do it. You is the most wonderful being I have ever known. I have See, I heard that idiot say that when I first pie. logged in, and I thought it was the funniest thing in the world. Eat the pumpkin pie. So, there's one thing 
I I have noticed that's actually gone. That I can't. That I'm a little upset. It's bothering Every me a little. Uh. Winter item for a bargain. Um. And what it is is I don't see any of the uh, winter food available to purchase, which stinks because. Do you have any recipes? You needed that to make the winter triple. You know, the this winter triple buffs you for winter for stuff. Business. I'll go over it right now. Ah, damn it. Let me finish eating these pies. <laughs> I'm just so hungry. Do you have any recipes? Alright, eat the lemon pie. Eat it, you fat bastard. Peace is if you do your, you have business. like a minute and a half to get pies. If you do it in ten, if you get ten pies, you get a decent... Uh, amount of rewards, but the thing is, like certain pies you eat quickly. Damn. See, I usually get nine. Do you have any recipes? Once I got ten, I was happy with that. All right, so talk to pie eating contest, Breen. I'm finished. Count my pies. A wise Collect my rewards. I mean, that's the stuff you get. This is the way. The the hardest things to get is the two things for the scarf. Ugh. Oh my god. Oh, that felt holiday. good. I stretched. Okay. The hell was I talking about? Oh yeah, the triple. So the triple, it gives plus five genius. repel resistance, plus five uh, knockback resistance, so plus five enhanced. cold resistance, and it says AOE b bonus during winter events. So what it looks like, it's a little candy cane thing. It makes known. you snow around you. It's really cute. You can use it all year. It's just a, it's really good here. Uh, is good for business. I forget what the added bonus is, actually. I wish you would list that. Q is the most wonderful being I have ever known. Was it saying info? I have winter items for a bargain. Mm. Now it just says like the only thing different says this triple seems to have munched Peace on something festive. Happy holidays. It has modified its physiology. It has adapted well to cold and seems quite playful. Even for a triple, it has the fear of Klingons or other hostile species. Which is not um include Do you have uh, recipes? It's just Klingon faction people. He talks about recipes. I'll let him talk about it because his Happy Holidays. Q I hate his voice, that's why. Discover new foods, combine spices in strange new ways. And to boldly bake what no one has baked before. If you bring me a recipe Let's from make a the tasty treat together, I will send you to collect the ingredients. Bring them back to me, and I will reward you handsomely. Save the gingerbread men from those dreadful snowmen, and you may find a recipe or two. Do in you the gingerbread have any home. recipes? Happy holidays. Q has graciously scattered the necessary ingredients all throughout Winter Wonderland. You'll never know what you'll find. I got one of the recipes. Um, it's just a fruitcake recipe. That's the only way you can get the Winter Triple. So we're going to see exactly what's going on, because he made it sound like a mission. Talk to the chef. Happy holidays. Last year's fruitcake. Okay. I have ever known. Collect the ingredients. So you need... You will receive last... Collect the ingredients for last year's fruitcake and return to the Winter Wonderland chef. Accept. Happy holidays. Q has Where do I, me to discover what ingredients food. do I need for last year? First, I will need the main ingredient, Bajorn Mappa bread, which should be available from your replicator. Then I will need sugar and ginger, which you should be able to find in Winter Wonderland. Alright, so replicate, replicator. Hopefully I have some of those. Do you have a delightful treat to try? Where's this bread? And Dorian, no, it's a root. Bajoran Mappa bread. Okay, replicate. Yep. Right, got Q the bread. is the most wonderful Talk being I chef. have ever known. Happy holidays. Q has charged me to this. Alright, what do I need? I need sugar and ginger. Do I have that? Q is the most wonderful being I have ever known. Where can I get sugar and ginger? 
Huh. Where would I get those? Do I get them from here? Well, let me talk to this guy. He might know. Huh. I feel pretty stupid now. A wise man can hear profit in the wind. Sugar and ginger. Do I get them here? Oh, wait. What's this? Oh, look at that. This is going to be longer than I thought. All right. Um, you is the most wonderful being I have Not ever known. So that's up by the green ship. It's convenient. It's over here. It's actually right on top of the camp. Damn it. And there are these snowmen here. Oh, I can sneak by. Look. Look, I can sneak by. Give me. Give me the sugar. I like how it's just a big bag that says sugar. This is really cute. I'm digging this. Damn it, the other one's way down there at the other hut. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Leave me alone, please. I'll help you, sir. There you go, I saved you. Saved your life. You would have died otherwise. Ugh. And that's just... Wow, it really does look like ginger. I love this. Ginger. Alright. Last year's fruitcake complete. Alright, let's go get the fruitcake. I rule all the lands and of ice ice and snow. snow. I did also notice that they brought that up to uh, 50. They brought it up 50 extra kills. Didn't really make a difference. Ugh. Alright, cool. Not affected me. Ugh. Alright, so. Let's bring it. Let's bring it to the dumb chef. Chef dummy. Winter chef. Alright. Sweet, continue. Happy holidays! Alright, so wow, now I have holidays. six of the fruitcakes. And I got some other stuff. Cool. Actually, got a lot of stuff. Is that from. That's from I the Winter Overlord, winter okay. So basically, bargain. fruitcake. Where'd it go? Where's my... F okay, so it's in my devices. So if you want a winter treble, you gotta get a recipe, Happy shove one holidays. of these in your inventory with one treble. And that's it. Tribbles spawn I out another one. Winter and uh, that's everything. Bargain. It's really quick and easy. And I think I'm gonna can my... Uh, eh, I'll keep it. Alright. Yep, that's it. Alright, so that was that annoying jerk. You start the winter, winter, uh, the gingerbread colony protection thing there. Uh, I'm going to do it with another character, though. And I'm going to have an annotation for that video uh, now. Do you need to be saved? I got you, buddy. Wonderful! You rescued a gingerbread council member! Welcome back. Or if you didn't leave, because I, I'm editing things. <laughs> um, that's pretty much it. That's all that's here. The big thing's the uh, ship. I'm glad I could use some of the same footage as last year. Some of the things I said weren't true last year, but that's okay. Because I hope I went over them now. Can I knock you down? Haha, <laughs> take that. So, like and favorite. You can like if you if this made you happy. You can favorite if you want. You can subscribe too if you want. I always like putting Star Trek on here. Ugh, that's it. I'm the F-Bomb here in Nick Bro Link. And enjoy your holiday.